During the launch of the 2023 Chemistry Olympiad, Dean of the Faculty of Science and Technology at the University of the West Indies, St. Augustine, Dr. Brian Coburn said, we must raise our competencies in chemistry and our capacity for innovation if we are to reach the next generation of chemists. These international science events are aptly named Olympiads as they gather those who have some natural aptitude and have combined it with rigorous and sustained training, like the Olympics. Winner of the Top Form 2 Student 2022 prize, Anastasia Abbey said she wasn't expecting to win, but described the experience as very rewarding, adding that she put a lot of work into the competition. She is a student of Coover East Secondary School. I pursue chemistry because it's one of my favorite sciences, personally, and I just really enjoyed it in school, thankfully, in part, Mr. Ducrell, um, and my other, my first form, form one teacher who introduced me to chemistry as well, Ms. Josim. So it's really all due to them. The first place National Junior Chemistry Olympiad winner, Jaron Mohammed, also expressed his surprise at winning the top spot and thanked his teacher, Mr. Ramesh Dukaran, for all his support. Jaron, who is also a student of Kuva East Secondary School, won the Top Form 5 Student Award in the Junior Chemistry Olympiad. It took a lot of effort indeed, um, especially going through, um, going through all the content and balancing. It was very close to my CSEC exams, balancing my CSEC exam with that. And it was during the pandemic when we had to switch to online. So it was very challenging, but it was a very nice experience. It taught me how to balance my time very efficiently. Education Minister Dr. Nian Gadsby Dolly was very pleased with the students' performance and encouraged the faculty to expand the Olympiad to the other sciences such as physics and biology. Kimberly D'Souza, TTT News.